In this video for the Beacon Hill dollhouse construction, I'm going to go over Section E, Tower, Front, and Interior Partitions. This begins by telling you to remove and prepare the tower front wall. And yes, this is a part of this section, but there are actually a few other parts that you're going to have to remove and prepare as well. This includes some of the interior walls as shown in the image here. Since these pieces are going to be used for interior and exterior walls, I just used my primer coat. I followed the instructions to first install the tower front wall. Then I proceeded with the first floor dining room, living room partitions, and then to the second floor partitions for the bedroom and the closet. I made good use of the quick grip clamps as much as possible to hold the pieces together firmly while the glue was drying. And then throughout the entire section, I was using masking tape to hold many of the other areas together. The next step was to install the third floor partition. As I was installing this, I realized that things were starting to get a little bit out of alignment and I brought in my strap clamp. I wrapped this around the entire perimeter of the house at the same level of the third floor. As I tightened this clamp down, it pulled everything together, created a, created a little more squareness and rigidity to the entire body. The final part of this section is to install the second and third floor back edges. This aligns right at the floor level of the second and third floors. I initially did this with wood glue, you know, and it, and it held fine for the most part, but over time as I was working on the house, this did start to pull away. And later I used super glue. So something to keep in mind as you're putting this in you may want to use something stronger than wood glue when you're installing this. Thanks for watching.